The last 100 years have seen amazing scientific breakthroughs and the development of thousands of medicines from multitude of diseases. Several diseases have proven hard to treat, but some of the smallest building blocks of life itself are providing physicians and scientists with innovative treatment options, biotherapeutic medicines. An exciting and promising field, harnessing the power of living organisms, such as cells or bacteria. Scientists let these organisms do what they would naturally do, or modify them to produce proteins or antibodies that are used in biotherapeutic medicines. These medicines are designed to replace a naturally missing protein, as is the case with diabetes patients lacking insulin, or perform a specialised task. For example, a monoclonal antibody can bind to a protein on the surface of a cancer cell and guide the body's immune system to destroy the tumour. Biotherapeutic medicines benefit more than 350 million patients worldwide, treating prevalent diseases as well as rare illnesses. So what makes biotherapeutic medicines different from other medicines? Chemically synthesized medicines are normally made using a chemical or mechanical process, whereas biotherapeutic medicines are produced by living organisms. The molecules of chemically synthesized medicines tend to be small in comparison with biotherapeutic medicines, whose molecules are far larger and more complex. If you were to make a transportation analogy, the molecule of a typical chemically synthesized medicine would have the size and complexity of a bicycle while a biotherapeutic antibody would have the size and complexity of a passenger plane. What's more, developing and manufacturing biotherapeutic medicines are extremely challenging. When developing a biotherapeutic medicine, years of research focus on finding the right organism and manufacturing conditions to produce the required protein or antibody. In fact, even small changes in the manufacturing process can alter the final product. That's why precision and conformance to scientific requirements are necessary to ensure quality, safety and efficacy. Scientists must create the right environment for cells to isolate and purify the biotherapeutic protein so it's exactly the right product every time. If not done correctly, the patient's immune system will see these molecules as invaders and might start to react against the biotherapeutic medicine. Or even worse, the immune system could turn against similar natural substances. In everything scientists do, patient safety comes first. Science-based standards and regulation are essential for the development and manufacture of biotherapeutic medicines. Over the past 30 years, medical advances in biotherapeutic medicines have focused on treating many chronic diseases as a positive result of the biotechnology revolution, this new generation of treatments is now making a genuine difference in the lives of people that were previously left untreated. Research in biotherapeutic medicines continues to find new treatments for many other conditions, using the power of life for life.